Hello, everybody. Welcome to Deep Oak and Unsolved, where we explore the unknown of this recovering game. Races aren't as big as a thing as they once were in Monad's past game, Rogue Lineage. They usually give a little side bonus that aren't really that impactful, so as a result, players don't really have much of a focus on them. Something, however, caught my eyes in my DMs, which was a picture of what appeared to be someone with pure white hair and pure white skin with some other accessories. My first thought was that it probably was an Etrian with some sort of hair combo from the Roblox catalog or barber. However, I looked a bit closer at my screen and noticed blue particles around the person's head. Another thing to note was the fact that there were clearly horns sticking out from the back of the hair that wasn't colored white, and usually when you have accessories with the hair, it usually is also the same color as the hair. If you add the fact that this person was also Camellia Officer, it made it pretty clear that this was the Senior Modichura. What further reinforced this fact is by what was said when I was doing a podcast in my Discord server. Achura first asked for pick permissions, and afterwards posted an image of what appeared to be the first few letters of a race and its description. People were quick to point out that it was an Adret because of what was said, but if you look at the Adret's description, it does not start with the words, the first, like what was said in Achura's image. For a while, I couldn't really figure out what the description could be referring to until I came across this image in the content creator chat. The chat reads, well, we are the first grammar. Putting two and two together, it's more than likely what the description was referring to. I could of course be wrong about this, but we have seen several examples of this before, such as the Primal Vesperian. So, this race being something that actually exists, well, that's true. I don't think someone like Atro would show to this degree. She's also a senior mod and is pretty high ranking in the Deep Oak community, and we have seen people such in the tunes get special races, so it's no surprise there. As for if anyone will actually be able to obtain this race, probably not, but it'd be cool to see if it was somehow obtainable in layer 2. It's been a while since my last Unsolved. I hope you enjoyed the video and have a great day. Peace.